everyone welcome to my vlog my name is Scott um, today was a pretty good day I mean the weather is very nice it's like 65 degrees outside give or take um, that's my phone um, you know it's very nice outside I mean it's it's not hot it's not cold it's not windy I mean it's a fantastic day outside other than the fact that you know I had to work um, but even work wasn't that bad it was pretty good I went to lunch today on my way back you'll never guess what I saw so I'll, I'll tell you uh, the girls gone wild bus yes you heard right the girls gone wild bus uh, apparently I got back to the office all excited I was telling everybody and the manager said they've been in town up here in Lebanon for a few days now so I don't know if it's because of Silverado's or the college or what up here but they're in Lebanon go figure uh, thought that was kind of cool uh, I've been telling everybody it's going in my vlog today because you know it's just awesome yeah. it's very cool it's weird but cool uh, rented two movies from Redbox going to watch them when I get home. Kung Fu Panda 2 and Fright Night. So we'll see how Fright Night is. Kung Fu Panda 2 is awesome because, you know, the first one was awesome. And I went to the theater, seen this one, and it's awesome. So, uh, but that's pretty much all I got for today. I mean, no real big news. Uh, I take that back. I did see something on, uh, Yahoo News, I think. I'm pretty sure it was Yahoo News about uh, an 18 year old getting screwed over by his bank. Um, he apparently had a savings account, which uh, you have to have a minimum of so much money, like five dollars in it or something. And he was like five eighty or four eighty five or something. And uh, which you know, it's easy to forget about that in a savings account. You know if you're not putting into it regularly or something it's easy to forget because you know or they might have done him like they did me and opened his savings account without wanting one you know um, and they tried to do me the same way uh, <laughs> and they are trying to get two hundred and twenty nine dollars in fees out of him and you know for not having five dollars in there he had 485 okay that's bull crap I'm sorry that's not that's not right you know if uh, you know maybe they should have you know if a few weeks go by and he's not put any money in it or taking any money out of that maybe they should send you a notice first before they charge you anything to let you know you know I, I don't think it's fair the bank fees are ridiculous nowadays and it's you know they try to get you for anything you know and it's ridiculous people who are trying to do right by them and everything and they're getting fucked basically and it's a necessary evil I hate banks I wish there was a way I could get out of using one but you know it our work kind of requires that we have direct deposit and I hate it I mean I really do not like you know having to deal with a bank if I don't have to um, excuse me and uh, this kid you know an 18 year old kid just gets shafted you know and it's not right uh, like I said they tried to do the same to me and I didn't even open the savings account they automatically gave it to me when I opened my checking account and I'm like they tried to get me for like 200 something dollars I'm like no that ain't gonna happen I got the paperwork here you know nowhere in it did I say I wanted a savings account so uh, they closed it out and didn't charge me anything they said we'll do it this time but I'm like you have no choice I didn't request a savings account so yeah of course I said it in a more rude manner because they were talking down to me and being jackasses so naturally the redneck came out in me so uh, <laughs> but I completely understand where this kid's coming from and their whole argument is you know well he 
should have had his five dollars in there. Which you know that's come on that fifteen cents, and you're gonna accumulate that up to two hundred something dollars, and not even send him a notice beforehand to say, hey, you know your balance is low. Maybe you should, you know, put money in there so we don't charge you fees. That would be acceptable. I would understand that, but you know the bank he's using is the same one I'm using, and they don't do that. They're just, fuck the people who give us money. Let's you know try to meet our overhead. So I, I feel sorry for the kid. I hope he, you know, they see the error of their ways and fix their problems. So, but that's pretty much all I got. Uh, as always, if anything interesting happens, I will turn the camera on and let you guys see it. If not, this will be the last you see me till tomorrow. So have a good one.